come to the one of the things generally we are doing all middle class that is called rd recurring deposit what is a recurring deposit same amount of money like it is just reverse of emi emi we are we have taken the money and we are paying monthly in the form of equal installment a recurring deposit is we are depositing certain equal amount every month and after certain number of years we are collecting the total money that is just beauty or you can say just reverse of emi emi first we have taken money and we have done the repayment and recurring deposit we are just keep on depositing the money and we are receiving the total amount matured amount after certain number of years then recurring deposit suppose per month money deposited in a rd is pm just for notation purpose for n month the monthly interest rate is rm this all our notation nothing else total amount after n month how to calculate the money you will put for the first month or just suppose you are collecting the money after 3 years means 36 month is the total tenure for rd means your rd will matured after 36 month just i am telling you one of the example then first month whatever whatever you will put the money you will get the interest for that money for 36 month very clear because you have given in first month and you will get matured in after 36 month now you will put again same amount of money in second month but for second month you will get the chance to get the interest only for 35 month because one month already already elapsed already gone a, a third deposit you will whatever you will deposit in third month for that amount you will get only 33 month fourth month you will get only 32 month means once you are keep on depositing the next to next next to next money you will get one month less time for interest that is only calculation and we have to add all then you will get the total amount matured amount like month one you have put the pm amount then you will get the interest for n month entire 36 month or n month in interest is rm then you will get pm into n into rm by 100 month 2 whatever you put the again equal amount pm you will get the chance to get the interest only for n minus 1 month because one month is out month 1 is out then out of n month you will get the chance for interest n minus 1 month rate of interest rm is will be pm equal to n minus similarly month 3 you will get the chance for n minus 2 month last month whatever you will put you can just put dot 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 just keep on you are doing the last month it will become pm and number of month will become 1 and rm pm equal to 1 into rm equal like this month first first uh, first date you have put the amount pm and next month first first you will get the matured amount then last month whatever you have put that you will get only one month for maturity then you will get the interest for only one month then you just add if you will all add what anything you are finding pattern this n n minus 1 n minus 2 1 these are only difference remaining are common pm by pm into rm by 100 this is common this will become common pm into rn into by 100 if you will add it will become n plus n minus 1 n minus 2 it will be what is this one summation of n summation of n natural number what is this formula we know into n into n plus 1 by 2 or nc2 both are same n into n plus 1 by 2 then n into n plus 1 this is a just find of triangular number sum of sum of n n natural number will give you the triangular number then n into n plus 1 by 2 into pm into rn by 100 that will give you the total rd amount after maturity means just you can write in the form of this one amount will become n into n plus 1 by 2 into pm into rn by 100 what is n here n is number of month rn is the interest rate of interest and pm is the equal amount of money whatever you are putting monthly